Hello, my name is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'll show you um, a solution to a problem that uh, some people had. Um, usually, when you create a page, um, it doesn't matter if you're on the communication site or um, team site, uh, the home page uh, is very uh, clear and uh, but when you try to create an uh, additional page, so I'll go to new and choose a new page and create it, you notice that there's the top banner that is here that is different from the home page. It's the same in communication and in team site. Um, so let's just uh, try something. I'll put some text here, but yet. Uh, even if I change change the layout to the plane, I still have the area of the banner and with the the name of the page. That is something that is not that aesthetic. If I if we compare it, of course, to this page, it has no page uh, header. This is already um, a web part. And uh, there's a solution for that, or a workaround. So the workaround is as following. Now what we need to do is to identify this page. So we'll go to the gear icon and go to site content. And then here we'll go to site pages. The, the home site is usually called home. And you see it's even created by the system account. If we go inside, we, we will see that this is the page. So let's go back again. And what we want to do is duplicate this home page, rename it, and then uh, we can use it. We can use it. So um, what we will do, we will take the home page, click on the dot dot dot, and do copy to. Then we will just say copy it here. We will see that a copy called home one has been created. Now what we can do now is click the dot dot dot. We can rename it and give it a new name. Let's call it demo two. Okay, now the name is different. So it's different than the home. Um, but if you notice on top, we still have that it's called home. So what we can do is click the dot dot dot, go to more, go to properties. And here, if we edit all, we could change the name, the technical name. So no, we won't change the technical name. We will change the title. So also here we will call it demo two. And now if we enter the new page, we can edit it because we duplicated it. Now we can arrange it as we want. And we will also here see that the title of this page is the same. I'll demonstrate it also on a team site. So let's create a team site. I will go to SharePoint. I'll create a new site. I'll choose from a team site. I'll give it a name, demo one, two, three, and I'll do next. Okay, this is a new page. Now you see here we have a home page which has no title and or nothing. And if we create a new name new page, we'll see that we we get the, the banner even if we change it to plain and we need to so we'll do the same thing here we will go to the gear icon click uh, site content here we will choose site pages we will go to the home page do copy here copy to and copy here now we can rename it 
we can rename the the page to demo two and we will go to the more properties and change the title to demo two as well let's do x now if we go to this demo two it looks totally like the home page see this is demo two we will go to the home page it looks and now actually we can edit it and we get the experience without the, without the title of the page and the banner so this is what I wanted to show you uh, try it out uh, if you like this channel you can subscribe and see you next time have a good day goodbye